around filming these videos. Let's hope it works this time. What's up, Peter Birth? Today is the 31st of May, which is the last day in May, um, 2015. So I'm going to do May 2015 favourites for you. And tomorrow's school, because it's like the end of the half term, May half two now, Saturdays. So, first um, theme is going to be beauty. So the first thing is the Wells Years Almond Sensitive Skin Soothing Cleansing Lotion and it gently cleanses and prevents dry skin and it's free because it's free. It smells kind of almondy of course and it looks a bit rosy so it does smell roses I think. Um, but um hasn't got any artificial things in it to make it smell nice basically. It's just white and you saw it on my weekend morning routine on 4 filming friends. The next thing is similar to it and it is in the same shape and it's also world years. Almond sensitive skin, soothing facial cream, gentle and protecting and calms delicate skin. It's fragrance free also and it's for sensitive dry skin like mine because I get a lot of eczema especially on my arms by here and on my neck around here. It smells exactly the same as that one but um, this is also used in the routine I did on the second account and um eczema see scratching um the thing is with this one you do have to wipe it off your face like i did on the thing because that one's acts more like soap and this one is basically a facial moisturizer i think this counts as beauty not random but this is a toothpaste i've been loving this it's also on routine um if we say routine it's on the routine so this is a kingfish fisher fennel natural toothpaste and it's fluoride Free. and it's 100 ml 50 ml no 30 ml and that's 75 ml that big one um what i like about it, it says ingredients where it comes from what it does there's three ingredients on there from fennel and they both do the same thing which is for the fresh fresh taste as you can see that um it's 100 ml doesn't do much foaming a normal to it does it has water in it which is a moisture and it comes from purified water um there's also a red one but there's non fluoride fluoride um free so it has got fluoride in it so, but this one's nice and it come and i got it from horns and barrett the one in Cumbra. this is what it comes from basically looks like if you ever played the game um the last of us it looks like the um clicker zombies heads on it so <laughs> yeah this is what it looks like when it grows you can grow them at home this is fennel i've just been saying it's it smells exactly the same and it probably tastes the same too so that's that every time i go to supermarket I'll, fennel <laughs> like a solvent routine also um this is the body bot um, body shop shimmer cubes or cubes of mer in french um th these used to be my favorites which is mint green and silver gray um, my new favourite is actually Pure Turquoise, this one, I've been wearing it quite a bit, um, I wore it on the routine anyway. This one, no one says much about this one, it's called Florist Green. Uh, this is probably going to be next favourites now and these lot are going to be wiped right out of it. <laughs> Three minutes, doing good Laura, doing good. My mum actually got me these from Body Shop and Cabran and they were put in my Christmas stocking in 2014. The next one is always in my favourite videos, all the ones I've done in the past, I know I don't do them often. Well, it does, but it's extreme length sensitive number seven mascara in 01 black shade. <sighs> I think it's drying up a little bit, but and it does stick a bit in your eyelashes. I've got it on today, that's the only makeup I've actually got on today because it's Sunday and I'm going anywhere. I don't really go anywhere on Sundays except church, but I hate. Um, <laughs> this is seven mil, really, that's barely anything. Um, so yeah. I love it so much. Next is clothing and goodness sake. <laughs> um this is the thing. Then and Jeff and my mum bought me it from the you know It's from T U or T U in the Sainsbury section. Um it's made in Bangladesh. Size twelve in women's. Um this outer, so this bit is made ninety nine percent cotton and one percent elastic lining. And inside is 65% polyester and work at the maths, comment below. Uh, yeah, it's 
the rest is 35% cotton, so. Yeah, and I've not really said anything about the buttons, but I love it so much. It's kind of a short one, so it shows a bit of the top that you wear underneath it, so. Yeah, I haven't worn this top in ages, by the way. At first, I didn't really want to wear these that my auntie gave me, but because I was like, oh, I want to wear my sandals because we're going on rocky beaches from where she lives and all this. But, and she was saying, oh, um, it's like a three year. It doesn't really with me. <laughs> um, they are low tops and a navy and are a size six. Really beachy, especially inside. It's from the Green Flash Shoe Company from the UK. She got them just to use and then she was like, no, I don't want to use them anymore, give them to Laura. So, yeah, and I didn't really want to use them because I wanted to wear my sandals, but they were the only things that came into that to borrow her shoes and then she let them take them out. So that's the story of those little babies. Wrong way around. So these are the sandals I actually wore. My mum brought them for me. I love them. They're very country type swifty. They're foot glove, will the fit, and they're wide and they're five and a half, which is very, 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 very weird. And my feet are awkward and they were quite wide, but they're 39 millimetres wide, I think. Um, it's quite awkward for my shoe size, so they're perfect fit basically. They've got little plaits and little holes in at the top. I find the holes me weirdly. And I don't, they've got better because I don't really need to undo them. They're leather. Look at these bits of leather. As you can see, because there's like little bits come off in this one leather as well these are from m s marks and spencers next is randoms not the sweets um my first random is geek girl i'm currently on chapter 29 29 <laughs> so 21 i'm a book mom that's because she's a geek and yeah basically <laughs> yeah that's my bookmark if you're wondering this is the font yeah um, it's basically about a geek, by oh, holy smell, it's the first series, about a geek who's like, I'm fed of being geek because everyone hates me and then she wants to be some cheeky, popular girl then. So I'm on chapter 20 on. So she, and she's only just made up her mind like, do you know what, I want to be different now. So yeah. Next thing is this, which I got for Easter. Two things I got from Easter now, if you saw my Easter haul. Tossed your knowledge. And uh, my auntie's hospital patient in Griffin. She had a hedgehog. As you know the story, she prefers owls to hedgehogs, but she thought I didn't like the hedgehogs, so she gave me the owl instead. It's weird. Anyway, <laughs> so yeah, his name's Quartz. E, Quartzy. Spelled with an I or a Y, I haven't decided yet. I called Mix some obsessed with all these stones, and he's white, because most quartz are white, and um, just normal quartzes. The first one. I don't know what Minecraft is, but it's there. So I thought Quartz, and then I thought. Not really a name, Quartzy, so that's what it is. Maybe I Z E in the end. Um, this is my next one. I made this. I accidentally did that, didn't I? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my god. It's a bunch of quotes in there. Uh, <laughs> I didn't even know that one was on there. Oh wow. <laughs> anyway. So it's just bits from the same magazine to home magazine, by the way. I don't know where that word came from. So I just chopped up bits of it and all. It's, from, it's actually an Easter present, so there's one, two, three now. Yeah, that's about it. And so I, I tipped up to that just to make it a bit more interesting, a little slit. I've got two quotes in here. One's from the one only the other days, and it's called Be Happy, um, Do What Makes You Happy, I think. And then the other one I got from the internet and put on Instagram though. and it was oh, don't worry about those who talk behind your back they're behind you for a reason this was originally an uh, Easter present for my dad and he was a mini egg container I love the smell of it so much doing the smelly thing again the next thing is this which my friend Marky um, got me Abby and another another friend I'm like I mean in Cardiff um, made in China there was a blue, a purple, and a green one too. But I got the orange, which is my third favourite colour. So right. <coughs> You're not supposed to do that one, but I like it's like a backwards one, so that. Um, but yeah, just got it for it. Our lips are moving. Your lips are moving. 
Yeah, let's start moving. Na 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 baby. And then the last one is, or the last one is, um, actually, I you know on my card before I quickly show you that picture and I have one, two, three, four, not the spotty one in my name. And they had like shells in it and they had drawn in ball pen and I had like, it was different colours and all, yeah. So that's pop art and I've been obsessed with that, that's my favourite art lately. Here are a few examples, there is this lip one that I found, glasses one I found. So this is the one that I got the basic idea from for my masterpiece. And this one is my background screen on my iPad. And this one I quite like. It's just, um, this one's Roy Lincolnstein's, I think. And I think these three are as well. So, that those four. And if you've seen my own, um, pick right in the comments which one you prefer out of those four or five. So, thanks for watching, guys. Subscribe, like, comment if you want me, my videos, or both. My Follow my Instagram, which is officially underscore Laura HP. Not actually the word underscore the scroll um, and the second account which is for film and friends and the girls on there as well which are butter babes heaves which is amy's and maddie pa which is obviously maddie's and mia shores which is obviously mia's so follow them as well so thanks for watching guys and bye views with I got them all in a box over there to carry them down.